As they told me other childhood stories, they knew that I stood close, but but never close enough to touch the holy union of their bonding, which, which I wish to touch so fondly with my heart, and, and maybe somehow more. But but they had a way of keeping it away, while, while never seeming less than just big and open, friendly doors. Well, then one day it finally happened. Just before they took a nap, we joked around the room and would say slept. They were kidding me about an incident when I kicked out some rowdy, shouting something near the door. They said that I'd looked afraid, and if I didn't act my age, well, then they'd have to hold me back next time. <laughs> I laughed and said that it would take more than just two freaks to, to make me stop if something interrupted us again. And with that, we started shoving back and forth and until a sudden move caught me completely off my guard. They reached around, surrounding me within a wall of flesh. I found my only freedom left was in my hand, which dangled up and down between their sides until I jerked and seemed to watch it flutter down upon their joints. moment slipped into the room, and it wasn't there before. Looking up, we all connected in a triangle of eyes, reflected tension and unsaid excitement, too. Then it passed in nervous laughter, but, but I sensed a change. Soon after, we unlocked our limbs, and I withdrew.